In this video, I will be revealing 5 awesome fiber hacks that can boost your fiber seals. As you can see, um, this is the first hack. Yeah. This is the second hack. The third hack. And the fourth hack. The fifth hack. I, and also, I have a bonus um, hack for you. Just before I continue the video, if this is your first time visiting my channel, um, kindly hit that red subscribe button and also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that whenever I upload new videos like this, you'll be the first to get notified by YouTube. Also, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. This really, really helps in boosting uh, the YouTube algorithm. So without further ado, um, let's get started. All right, um, welcome back to the video. As you can see, these are the five, five hacks, including the bonus hack. Um, the first hack is something called the click-through rate or CTR. And this is determined by your um, gig thumbnail or gig image. Uh, for instance, let's head now to Fiverr. Let's head to, head to Fiverr. For instance, we search for this keyword, which is um, ebook writing. As you can see, there are so many, there are a bunch of um, sellers offering this particular service. But as you can see, um, out of these um, four, one, two, three, four, five, out of these five sellers, which of this, which of the, this thumbnail? like got your attention i believe um you might all agree with me this is this thumbnail is good and it's eye catching you understand so please make sure you design catchy thumbnail um using any um designing software like canva if you don't know how to get canva just visit my or use canva just visit my um visit my youtube channel as you can see in this particular video get canva pro for a lifetime you understand it has gotten almost 500 views you understand so quickly watch this video and get canva pro for yourself so that you can use um premium images and templates you understand for lifetime access you understand all right so you can use canva canva pro to design catchy um gig image you understand so how fiverr works is this if fiverr decides decides to like show your gig to let's say 10 potential customers you understand let's say for instance a potential customer search for this keyword ebook writing and fiverr decide, decided to show you a gig you understand to 10 potential customers if none of those um customers or buyers click through your gig you understand fiverr are going to take you down 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 below the the, the their search engine or algorithm you understand so in order to counteract that, make sure you design a catchy thumbnail. As you can see, this is catchy. Something like this. Just model this one or even design something better than this. You understand? As you can see, also this one is good. It got my attention. Um, the, 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 the sellers in this particular niche tried a lot. This one too is good. It's good. You understand? So make sure you design, design um, something catchy that is going to increase um, your click through read or CTR. Let's look at another niche. If you also visit, head on to Fiverr and search for this particular keyword, which is YouTube promotion. As you can see, um, this one got my attention. They designed this particular seller, Rockstar PK. Designed his geek thumbnail or geek image so catchy in the sun. So there's no way a client or potential customer that comes to Fiverr to purchase a service and come across this particular gig and won't click in the sun. Once it click, Fiverr will automatically increase or boost the ranking of this particular seller. You understand? So make sure you design something catchy, please. As you can see, all these gig thumbnails are good. Are good. Just visit visit Canva or any of the free um, designing tools and design um, something good for your for, for, for your account. You understand? All right, let's move to the next hack. All right, the second hack is gig SEO, which constitutes your gig. Your, your your keywords in your gig title your gig description and also the right um search tags so for instance if you head into fiverr and if you head into fiverr and let's say for instance we use this particular seller jeffers right as you can see um this is the gig title as you can see this seller have literally incorporated all his relevant keywords as you can see as you writer article writing all these are keywords you understand all these are keywords related to article writing you understand all these are keywords related to article writing again if you head on to description as you can see this seller literally incorporated or sprinkle all the keywords 
understand so that the algorithm will understand um what the what, what his account is all about you understand all right as you can see article writing as you writer writing article writing as you article blog post so this seller have, li have literally um optimized his gig for as you again also make sure you use the relevant search tags as you can see article writing blog post article writer um as you article you understand they are all related to article writing you understand all right so um gig as you is the most important aspect of fiber yeah it's the most important aspect um, on fiber okay if you also decide um to i i open also um this same seller is the same seller this is another gig for the, from the same seller as you can see ebook go, ghostwriter this is a qa ghostwriting this is another qa amazon kindly this is another qa as you can see ghostwriting in the gig description this is the gig description you understand ghostwriting ebook ebook ghostwriter ebook ebook writer <coughs> sorry ghostwriting ebook writing as you can see make sure you sprinkle you sprinkled all your relevant keywords all your relevant keywords you understand and also the the, the search tags amazon kind of ghostwriting ebook writer ebook writing ebook you understand so whatever the niche you are, you are into make sure um you use um your right or relevant um keywords all right so let's move to the sack so the next is thin online you understand this is very very important i experienced this myself you understand on fiverr um buyers or customers are given the power to to vet sellers based on categorically um based on those online and those offline for instance what i mean is this if you handle to five and let's say for instance i search for let's see ebook writing as you can see there are over seven thousand services or sellers offering this gig but a, a buyer can decide to filter all these sellers maybe the, the, the buyer wants something really 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 fast and want to order fast so the buyer will just click here you understand online and just wait and see as you can see as you can see once i click this button that's online sellers it automatically slash down the number to 237 have you seen the magic let me repeat again let me go back again as you can see there are over 7600 sellers you understand but immediately i click this online sellers online those online those sellers freelancers online just watch and see as you can see 232 sellers so if you are lucky and you are online your gig will automatically show to that particular um, buyer and boom you land an order so please make uh, staying online is extremely important you understand staying online on fiverr is extremely important if you want to stay online make sure you download you go to play store and download the fiverr app you understand download fiverr app and you keep um logging in and out or something like that and make sure you stay online again there are certain extensions we used before before now but they don't work anymore fiverr will just ban you temporarily you understand those auto refresh extensions they don't longer work you understand so you just have to use your phone and keep logging in and out or something like that so make sure you stay online please as you can see um uh, buyers have the power to 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 filter sellers in the, in the sun. and if they click online sellers and you are you have to be online let me tell you something your gig might show and you land an order so this is very very important again let's move to the next hack again this is very important avoid changing your gig title and your gig description after you publish your gig so many people are doing this wrong you understand so many people are doing this wrongly avoid changing your gig title and your gig description especially when after you publish your your, your your gig that causes the ranking you understand for instance now you can see this gig is already published so if i decide to go and change it now i'm telling you fiverr will derank you will send you to the last page where no any seller no way uh, no any buyer i mean no any buyer or customer will see your gig so avoid changing your gig title your gig title and your gig description after you publish your gig this is extremely crucial understand very very important please very very important so that's why i recommend you from start to finish you try as much as possible to create your gig in a professional way to avoid coming back and changing or editing anything as such understand all right let's move to the next act and again 
um, image as you. There is something called image as you. You understand? What I mean is this. Let's think for instance. Um, if you hand it to Google, if you hand it to Google and search a um, professional SEO article writer, you understand? What is this? Professional SEO article writer. As you can see, this particular gig that shows is from is from five. You understand? It's from five. I just search this keyword that's on Google, and this this gig or this image that shows is from Fiverr. It's from for, for a seller on Fiverr. As you can see, this is another um um is another gig for a seller on Fiverr. So definitely, these two sellers have literally optimized their their gig image for search engine as well. You understand? So all you need to do, let's say for instance, I'm coming. I'm coming. All right, let's continue. Let's continue. So let's take for instance. Um, this is my geek image. This, the, this is my the image I want to use. Um, or geek thumbnail. You understand? I want to use on my Fiverr geek. You understand? So to optimize it for search engine, just use relevant keywords. You just um, right click. You understand? Right click. You go to rename. Scroll down. You go to rename, and you write something like this. Um, since it's regarding ebook writing, you can write ebook writing ebook writing you can write ebook writer just use your your ranking keywords you understand um you can write also kindle ebook kindle ebook you can write amazon kindle all your relevant keywords you understand make sure you you, you, you include them in, in your image you understand as you can see ebook writer ebook writing kindle amazon kindle you understand writer you understand or ghost writer ghost so you are optimizing the geek image for search engine as well. You understand? Goes right and receive, and then you upload or something like that. You understand? That's how um these two um these particular um fiber sellers are ranking on Google when I search for this particular um keyword. That's it about um um image as you. You understand? And another one is videos. I don't usually use this a lot, but according to Fiverr, it can boost your rankings. Let me check if I can see um someone who, uh, exactly as you can see ebook writing. Someone is a video here, as you can see. So you can, as you can see, it is a video playing. It's literally a video playing and regarding the services you offer. So you can also decide to upload a video. It can boost um your your your, your rankings. And again, and um, if if you get um ranking boosting that's automatically you'll be getting sales on five hope you understand all right so let's move to the last um the last the, which is the bonus tip or bonus hack as you can see this is your title um on fiverr there's something called the SU title which is different from your gig title as you can see i'm inside one of my accounts as you can see this a, a gig regarding content writing so in order to view all as your title you just click this upgrade as you you understand as i told you mind you avoid changing your gig title and your gig description please after published you understand after your gig, your gig goes live avoid changing your gig title or your gig description but for the as your title you can play around with it with it you understand you just delete this and write your ranking keywords since this gig is relating to content writing i'll write content writing content writing separated by comma then um content writer you can write all your ranking keywords you understand content writing content writer is your content writer or something like that you understand or is your content you understand so make sure you use um your ranking keyword if you're into logo design you can write logo design minimum uh minimalist logo modern logo or something like that whatever the niche this works you understand so SEO title is very important. You understand? You can use your ranking keywords here. But avoid changing your gig title and your gig description. You understand? All right. I think I've, exa I've exhausted everything regarding um the five forever hacks. All right. Um, let me check. Okay. Yeah, I have exhausted everything. All right. Thank you so much for watching. And again, don't forget to check out my other videos. As you can see, I have a bunch of videos regarding Fiverr, regarding Upwork, and freelance writing in general. And again, if you're yet to subscribe, please hit that red subscribe button. If you have gotten value 
smash that like button. All right. Thank you so much for watching and see you again in my next video.